upwind on 29 or right, the 12150 static revs, uh, airspeed indicating by midfield with temperatures and pressure screen, uh, rotate at 60 knots, if we lose the engine at 100 feet we land straight ahead, 200 feet is bust up off to the right, 300 feet is over the tree line in the paddock, to the left, 400, 500 feet is golf course fairway, Six, uh, yeah, 600 feet is turn back for the southern grass, best glide speed 75 knots. Um, on the way out, we are going to climb to 1,000 feet, maintain 2.9 to the railway line, then we're going to turn to 2.4-ish. Uh, I, I checked windy, the wind is kind of all over the place, depending on the height. Um, anyway, it should be about 2.4.0 to uh, the Oaks. Going to look for Camden on the way. It points there. Uh, anyway, uh, when we get to the M7, sorry, at the railway line, we're going to turn to 2.4.0, set up a climb, block 1.2.0.0, climb Camden not above 2,500 feet. Uh, maintain 240 out there at the L-shaped lake. We can climb to not above 4,500 feet. Uh, and we're going to the Oaks to spin. Thanks, down ground. Helicopter Zulu, Zulu Tango with HTT. Request taxi to holding point Bravo 1 for a chopper's west departure. Information Delta. Taxi holding point Bravo 1, runway 29 to center. Taxi holding point Bravo 1, runway 29 to center, Zulu Zulu Tango. Taxi down ground, Charlie Golf Tango, Diamond Solo, Taxiway Lima, Information Delta, to Tamworth, request taxi and heritage clearance. Charlie Golf Tango, Taxi Alpha Runner Bay, is report ready in the bay. Taxi to Alpha Runner Bay, Charlie Golf Tango. Yeah, my friend, Michelle, right on Alpha, request taxi to Lima's Park. My friend, Michelle, taxi parking. Michelle, Michelle. Looks like 40 degrees. Uh, turn off the fuel pump for now. Bottle is at 1200. Oil temperature is 40 degrees. Make sure rich. At 1800. Low pressure screen. Fuel pressure 19. Volt meter is green. Suction is green. Maybe about a hundred. Bump over. Idle, good. One thousand. Things on ground. Kill pump. On. Pump shot, Romeo, Warrior, Mike. All right. Delta, request start clearance for circuit. November Fox. Why the second neck on the runway? Oh yeah. Thank, thank, you. thank you. November Fox shot, Romeo. Home. The what patrol? Dawn patrol. Oh, dawn patrol? Yeah. Oh, like people who go out at dawn? Yeah. Alright. Is it nice to go out at dawn? Is it pretty or something? No, just no wind. That's the only time they can fly because they're so hopeless. <laughs> <laughs> Uniform November Juliet, ready in the bay. Uniform November Juliet, hold position. Holding Uniform November Juliet. Thanks on ground, take them big kilo Sierra, taxi on Alpha, request taxi back to parking on Lima. Alright, let's go. Yep. Soar. Soar like a pelican. <laughs> They've had three, three accidents in the past 18 months. Have they really? They've totaled three Thank aircraft. You know, oh my god. Got, uh, hotel Yankee Tango. That's a lot. Oh, yeah. Taxi back to Bankstown helicopter with Delta. Yes, they've attracted the undivided attention of CASA. Yeah, I bet. They were closed for a week whilst they did an audit. Say that again? They were closed for a week whilst they did an audit. Oh, yeah, right. <laughs> but that was fun to cancel their appointments with their students. Oh, we have a CASA audit. Is there another one? Uniform 
Uniform November Juliet, clearance available. Go ahead, Uniform November Juliet. Uniform November Juliet, clear to Tamworth via Richmond. Maintain 3000, squawk 0306. Clear to Tamworth via Richmond, maintain 3000 feet and 0306, Uniform November Juliet. Uniform November Juliet, taxi holding point Alpha 8, runway 29 arrive. Holding by Alpha 8, runway 29 right, Uniform November Juliet. Thanks, Town Ground. Uh, Cherokee India Bravo X ray at Schofield requesting start up the circuit with information delta. India Bravo X ray start approved. Start approved, India Bravo X ray. And then Star Fox shut off dealer request. Back. Uh, how do you do it on this one? Thanks, Tower, Roman India Sierra November is ready at holding point Alpha 8, runway 29 on right for an upward departure. India Sierra November Tower, line up runway right. Line up runway right, India Sierra November. Oh. Hotel Tango yes. Golf is on base, full stop for the main pad. Hotel Tango Golf, main pad number one. Main pad number one, Hotel Tango Golf. Zulu Tango Wind, ready, make right turn, depart by Choppers West. Uh, departure of the West, Zulu Zulu Tango. India Sierra November, runway right, clear for takeoff. Clear for takeoff, runway right, India Sierra November. Uniform November Juliet, runway 29 right, ready via CTA departure. Uniform November Juliet, tower line up runway right. Line up runway right, Uniform November Juliet. Yankee Delta Lima, downwind, main pad, stop and go. Yankee Delta Lima, main pad number two, follow helicopter on final. Uh, Yankee Delta Lima, number two. Uniform November Juliet, report passing 2000, runway right, clear for takeoff. Runway right, clear for takeoff, Uniform November Juliet. Thanks, Down Tower. Helicopter Sierra Uniform Alpha, holding short of the main pad for an upwind departure. Sierra Uniform Alpha Tower, hold short of the main pad. Sierra Uniform left Alpha, five degrees. Short of the main pad. November 1 for a Choppers West departure with Delta. Helitech 201, tower depart, Choppers West, report airborne. Clear the bar, Choppers West, Helitech 201. 
Yankee Delta Lima, main pad, take stop and go. Yankee Delta Lima, that's so uh, Two zero be coming here, boy. Two zero. Navigate 240 is nil wind. We've got probably yep. 30 knots at height, but a feel of it. Wow, that's much more than wind you said, but you're right, we're not pointing the right way, are we? You can feel 30 knots, like you're just looking at the drift? Yeah. Yeah, okay. Is that more like it, or we want even more, maybe? Another 10 degrees. Okay, right. So, uh, Yeah. 
Uniform you know, November Juliet. That's the beginning of it. Right, okay. That's going to be all the crazy wind and stuff. Uniform November, you know, November Juliet. Bird Dog 273. Turbulence. Oh, because you get the mountain waves when that hits the mountain, say. Okay. Uh, track Direct McCall, Bird Dog 273. Lake is actually full. 24 climb 8. Oh, not normally. Uh, not this time of year, normally it's empty. Okay. Oh, that's no good for navigating. <laughs> Alright, I'm going to climb to 4,500. You identify, climb on the heading 5140 and expect a turn to the north shortly. Helicopters 
Zulu, Zulu, Tango again, sorry. Zulu, Zulu, Tango, stand by. It'll be a few minutes. Is it a bad idea to do spinning with the passenger? Bird Dog 273, contact Brisbane Centre. Oh, first up, yeah. If they've done some aerobatics in the past, then it's okay. Yeah, you can usually get a feel for who can handle what. Like, what's the, what's, what do you start with? A roll is easier, right? An air roll? No, 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 no. No? No, you start with a... Firstly, steep turns. Steep turns, right? Okay, two G turns, one left, one right. Yep. handle that. Then you do a loop. Okay. Uh, wing over. Uh, okay. If they can handle that, then you do the, 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 the yeah, loop, um, and then the stall turn last. Okay. If they can handle that, then next time out, take them out, spinning. Is, is a roll hard on them? The uh, aileron roll? Yeah. Okay. Because you're going up, then you stop, and then you roll. Oh, okay. The vestibular system is not used to the uh, I see. Okay. change. And for some people, the brain basically sends a warning signal to them to make them uh, okay. become nauseous in, in terms of stopping what you're doing. Okay, so it would be um, deep turns, wing overs, loops, then rolls and stall turns. Yeah. Okay. And then spinning. Yeah, right. One, two, zero, just stepping up underneath fast the following. Right, you want to make them sick to the falling loop. Two, zero, four, six, Sorry, oh, yeah, yeah, sure. Is that worse than spinning? Yeah. Okay. I guess it is really just all over the place. Yeah. Notice how long it's taken us to get out here? Yeah, it really has. Yeah, we're pushing into a lot of work. Yeah. That was the distance when we were back there, not far. And that's March this way, very quickly. Yeah, right, okay. Well, let's get it done and get out of here. <laughs> I work with a crazy Russian guy who is an avid uh, skydiver, and he and he really wants to come fly and do aerobatics. Yeah, he, he, he should be pretty good. Actually, he, he's been in light aircraft plenty, so I figure I figure he'll he'll at least have that skill. Yeah, no, he'll be he'll be fine. Yeah, they are crazy. Anyone anyway, who comes out of an airplane, it's really fly. crazy. He's crazy, yeah. I mean, you can tell it even not knowing he's a skydiver. Yeah, the skydivers are a certain breed of people. Yeah. And uh, when you meet them, you, you, you quickly work out that there's something not right. <laughs> yeah. Tango, ahead, your request. Uh, yeah, if we could possibly get a bond of five southbound, Zulu Tango. Zulu Tango, squad code 0423. 0423, Zulu Tango. I'll go to 6500. 6463, climb, flight over 1, 8, 0, 4, 6, 0. Zulu Zulu Tango identified verify altitude. 500 feet, Zulu Tango. Zulu Tango, contact departures 123 10. 1230, Zulu Tango. Uniform number joint, climb to 6500. 
739, contact Melbourne Centre 133 decimal 5. 1335, Melbourne 739, good day. Good day. Chogos Hanger climbed to 6500. Charlie Goff Tango. Charlie Goff Tango. Well, accelerate, then to do a steep turn to look out. Okay, we're at 6,500 feet. Canopy is locked. Flaps are up. Tripping for straight and level. Uh, no loose objects. Your harness is good. Yep. Engine temperatures and pressures look good. Fuel pump on. Looks good. Alright, I'm going to turn. Right, set. 55, okay, 24. 463, contact Melbourne Centre 118, decimal 5. 185, okay, 463, yeah. G'day. See anybody around? I will head for that corner. Do you have a preference for left or right? Uh, we'll go. We'll start with a uh, left-hand spin. Okay. Airspeed's good. 6,000 feet. 5, 8. Alright, throttle. I will have spinning left, dash, kick. Oh, the engine stopped. That hasn't happened to me before. Alright. Alright, dog it down. Wait, wait, wait. There it goes. Good. Throttle halfway. No traffic. We are at 4,000 feet and change. Engine sounds happy to you? Yeah. Okay, I'm gonna set up a climb. Looks like we're heading west. Oh, that's a first for me. <laughs> a little bit <laughs> nervous making, but it really is it, it it normally starts in the pullout, hey. Okay. You've told me that, but you know, <laughs> harder to trust. Yeah, when it's stationary like that, try to get to 135. Okay, don't pull out earlier. Yeah, there's okay. a tendency for you guys to be quite anxious because it's stopped. Yeah, well, it's first time, yeah. Yeah, so, uh, yeah, okay. just, just wait. That's why you were saying wait, get it'll, the airspeed. It'll start, if it starts windmilling, it starts, or if it's still stationary, pull 4G, it loads up one side of the prop. Yep. You got the fuel, you got the Maggie's on, it'll start. Okay. All right. Uh, yeah, the engine looks fine, fuel pump's still on. I'm gonna turn so we don't go too far this way. Actually, what, what is the boundary? It's way out there, isn't it? It's the escarpment. The escarpment. What, does that mean uh, where it drops? Yeah, Okay. the edge where it goes down. Okay, uh, not the first one, but the second one there? The, this first one. Oh, here. the first one, oh, they better turn then. Left, center, right. The red line follows this edge here. Okay. On the old Robins, which are carbureted, it stopped every single time. Uh, okay, because of the, carbur the carburetor gets, uh, what is it, the flow, po the flow pole overflows? Yeah. You're right. You get a rich cut. This one just stops. <laughs> because the, the idle tendon, or the idle power, with the rotational velocity, yeah, right. Basically overcomes the idle power and it just stops. Is it more likely to stop in one spin direction than the other? Yeah. Is left the likely one? Yeah. Okay. Five thousand five hundred. I mean, six thousand five hundred. Yeah, it's 
deafening silence, isn't it? Yeah, yeah, it really is. <laughs> That's the first time that the engine has ever stopped for me, like, in anything. I don't want to overshoot the oaks, so I'm going to turn again. Uh, center right. Traffic in your town now, we normally keep it full rich during the maneuvers, right? Yeah. yeah, I'm just burning off the plugs a bit because you saw, see how far out it is and we're climbing? Yeah, that's because the height. Okay. If you, if you constantly run it rich, it tends to carbon up the bike. Okay, yeah, right. And that can also cause it to stop in the yeah. premature. Ah, I see, okay. So should we make it rich before we uh, start the next one? Yeah, okay. I'll accelerate and do that maybe. How's your boundary going? Uh, not great. Left center, right. Might as well do this, Steve, and have a look out. Okay, now there's a VFR aircraft in your one o'clock, question two o'clock at one mile, unverified 2,500 feet, random Looks clear. Roger, the app is looking. Yeah, the wind's coming from there. Okay, so maybe we'll in that direction. Yeah, all right, turning in that direction. Okay, the that, that way we don't get blown out. Okay, thanks. Should I make it rich? Not yet, wait till you finish your turn and you pull the power back to idle, then you can make okay. it rich. Alright, we're spinning to the right this time. Unless I want to do it again. <laughs> Alright, now with the wind, maybe I'll give it a little while before I pull the power. Yeah. Okay. Maybe I'll go further left too. That's probably all right, hey? Yeah. Cut. Okay, you can put the mixture to rip now. Speed looks all right. Oxygen India. Thousand two hundred. At two RN identification terminate. Call the tower one three two. Nine five eight. Oh, there it goes again. Five seven. Five six. Five. All right. Throttle spinning right. Dash. Kick. All right. Now we're gonna let it hit one thirty five. Full four G. Is the engine good? Right. Traffic four seven. Engine going a little bit faster, everything sounds fine. Sounds good to me anyway. Okay, 110, heavy Sydney approach. Okay. There you go. Right. Engine looks alright. Yep. Frequency change approved. Now I turn that direction. Yeah, you can do a, do a 180 to the right. Alright, left, center, right. We'll level off at 4,000. Okay, we are at almost 4,000. Two engine stops in one day. There you go. Now I'm told that that's more likely when it's warm, right? But it's not particularly warm today, is it? Nah, not really. Stop your turn there. Uh, it's, I think the idle setting on this airplane might be low. wrong. Okay. 
If it's really low, when you're spinning like that, it'll tend to just go high. part of the river which is just in your one o'clock. Yep. That's where those really green paddocks are yep. that we're heading towards. Um, and um, that's about a thousand metres just to give you an idea of doing it in a box. I don't know, I was trusting the, mate, the compass, which is dumb. Yeah, well you saw it today, uh, Dirk Dirk yeah, yeah, coordinated yeah, the side yeah, not to work yeah, as well. So, either way, just look at the front. Yeah. The beauty of BFR. Yeah, the only time you can't do that is when you're in cloud. Yeah. <laughs> with IRM because this, uh, you know, the display is so dim yeah. and it was bright outside. I couldn't even read the, the indicator. <laughs> Yeah. Oh, that's no good. Yeah, it's really difficult to read, or it was last last Friday anyway, Thursday, whatever it was. And uh, rescue two zero four uh, request amended uh, level uh, three thousand uh, or four thousand visual if available. Rescue two zero four, what was your preferred altitude? Rescue two zero four, preferred three thousand visual if available. Rescue two zero four, Roger. Okay, you can do your hassle checks. Amended three thousand. Okay, well we're at four thousand feet. Rescue two zero four, spread and level. Our canopy is locked. Flaps are up. No loose objects. Your harness is good. My harness is good. My harness is good. My precision pressures look good. Fuel pump is on. Do you want me to do a 360 to look out? Yeah. Okay. Left, center, right. for about another two miles and then we can line up on the, okay. on the river. Here. It is. Cathay 110, contact Brisbane Centre 133 decimal zero. 133 decimal zero, Cathay 110. Cheerio. You see the straight river I'm talking about, aren't you? Yeah, right here. Yeah. So I'm going to turn on to it soon. Yep. Go. Yeah, that's it. That's a thousand metres, so you've got to contain everything within that. Okay. Oh, I've overturned. Sorry. So do I want to start now or...? Uh, no, no, not yet. Alright. I'll tell you when to start. Okay. That way you're right over the top of it. Alright.
which direction you want first? Uh, we'll go left first, because the wind is coming from the left. Okay. Okay, you can start your dive now. That was sloppy. <laughs> Very sloppy. Charlie Golf Tango, leaving to try airspace identification terminated, frequency change approved. Frequency change approved, Charlie Golf Tango. Thank you. Uh, with a salt turn, I really screwed up. Um, I, I suppose I was going too slow at the top. That you weren't in the vertical either. I went, ah, is that what it was? The wing wasn't perpendicular to the rise. Which what what was it? There's traffic low there. What was the uh, error? Like which which direction? You were on your nose when you kicked. I was, I was vertical. I was I was back. No, you're on your nose. Oh, I was not. Okay, that's all right. All right, all right. That. Um, yeah, the cartwheel was just a, basically a rotation. It wasn't a cartwheel. Yep. Okay, you got too slow. Okay. And um, too slow. Of, uh, too slow on nose. Okay. Yeah, your roll was a bit slow on entry. That's why the nose dropped. Yep. And um, you wing over. You started okay, but then you just rolled out too late. And we dived out of it. Okay. All right. Line up on the on the river. We'll do one sequence. We're moving to the right. This one or uh, the one behind us? All right. We'll go to that one. All right. I'll, I'll climb too. Actually, we'll do it on this one here. Okay. We'll oh, okay. stick to the one we've been doing. Okay. Then we're going to have to scoot on in because the cloud from the coast is starting to come over the aerodrome. Go. Okay. Runway 2 on ascent to in use. Wind of variable 5 knots. Cav OK. Temperature. They're saying Cav OK for the moment. Taking over. Yep. Right on top of it. Okay, thanks. Let's get able to see and they've got a wind that's pushing us this way, so you've got to go into it a bit. Now we're right over the top of it, see that? Yep. Right. Thanks. Off you go. Right. Everything to the right, to the right. We take a box shot, Sydney.
your medic checks. Okay. Uh, Tension, temperature suppressors look good. Pump off. Uh, heading south. And we are at 3,400 feet. Okay. Uh, should we go in? Yeah, we'll go okay. in now. Turn right. Turn left. Descending to 2,500. Sorry, Sydney Center, Victor Echo Foxtrot's now uh, two miles north of Wollongong. Passing 2,300, climbing flight level 210, awaiting airways, estimating uh, Odal at time uh, 23. Victor Echo Foxtrot, Sydney Center, good day, you are identified. No traffic, remain clear of car, Charlie Espo, so I will advise. Air remain clear, cast Charlie Airspace, and uh, would you like us to... No, we're not doing circuits to today, right? Or, uh, Correct. 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 Or we'll advise. Sydney Centre, good day, you are identified. No traffic, expected clearance, direct to TSAT, remain clear of class, Charlie Airspace, and leaving 5,000 call departures on 129 at seven. Current position now, direct to TSAT, remain clear of uh, Class Charlie Airspace and 129.7. Have a good day, Victor. Go Foxman. Good day. Victor, go Foxman, I feel like here the wind is coming from the north a little bit. Sydney approach. Uh, Singapore 212 request high speed. Singapore 212 cancel speed restrictions. Cancel speed restrictions, Singapore 212. Singapore Sound Transformation Echo. From my turn right for rail departures, frequency 132 decimal 8. From my turn left for circuit training, frequency 123 decimal 6. From my turn on ascent to in use. Wind variable 5 knots. Curve OK. Temperature 2 0. One zero zero six. On first contact, Bankstown Tower or ground. No fire receipt. Information echo. Echo. Bravo X-ray. All right, we have information echo. Uh, it's from a uh, two nine on right. We should expect to join crosswind probably. Um, variable wind five knots. Engine looks good. Charlie, follow Cherokee upwind from my left, plate touch and go. My left, Mike, Charlie. Thanks, Antel, uniform November Bravo, runway right, ready by crosswind. And have we got a southerly again, here? Uniform November Bravo Tower, runway right. Can't tell, maybe not. Runway right, clear for takeoff, uniform Yeah, we're going very Bravo. quickly now. Uh, so we've got wind up the arse. Oh, that's what it is, okay. Yeah. That's what it feels like, I yeah. see. There's a different wind, a different height. <laughs> it's really true. Any Bravo X-ray is downwind, uh, touch and go, request the glide. Any Bravo X-ray, copy the glide, personal head also glide. That's any Bravo X-ray.
down one touch and go. November Fox at Romeo. India Sierra November is inbound at 2RM, 1,500 feet with information echo. India Sierra November, target A, join crosswind, drum my 29 right, maintain 1,500. Join crosswind for 29 right, maintain 1,500, India Sierra November. Cherokee, November, Romeo, November, ready, runway, Alpha 829, right. Brace and pressure, just fix, make sure it's ready, fuel pump on, selection on, set for takeoff. Contents, pressure, warning line, your harness, your harness is good. Yep. Alpha 829, Bravo X-ray is going around. Indy Bravo X-ray. November, Fox, Romeo, runway left, clear, touch and go. November Fox right, Romeo, runway right, touch and go. November Fox right, Romeo, runway left. <laughs> <laughs> Nearly got it right. <laughs> it's an important distinction. Thanks, on Tower, for Pianki Golf is ready, holding point Alpha 8 for an upwind departure. Pianki Golf Tower, line up runway right. Line up runway right for Pianki Golf. Golf, from my right, clear for takeoff. From my right, clear for takeoff for Pai Yankee Golf. Zero Fox at Alpha, run my left, clear touch and go. On the left, uh, clear touch and go. Are we able to request a stop and go? Zero Fox at Alpha. Zero Fox at Alpha, A firm, clear to stop and go. Zero Fox at Alpha. Romeo Charlie. Thanks, Sensei. Good morning, Oscar. Zulu Alpha, Cessna 185, just approaching 2 and on the sense it's 1500. Receipt of Echo. Oscar Zulu Alpha, good morning. Join Crosswind, runway 29 right, maintain 1500. Crosswind 29 right, 1500, Oscar Zulu Alpha. Bravo X-ray, downwind, I'll do the call, okay. Bravo X-ray, right down. Robert, in the November, downwind, full stop, request flight approach. Indy November, copy the glide, cleared visual approach, runway right, number one. Cleared visual approach, runway right, number one, in the November. But you might do that. Mark Romeo Charlie, runway left, clear touch and go. Clear touch and go, Mark Romeo Charlie. Fire. Well, you've got to land on the runway, not across it, you know. Yeah. All right, fair enough. We're high, aren't we? <laughs> we had more speed than last time I did this. All right. In your zero November, runway right, clear to land. Clear to land, runway right, in your zero November. Way too high. Am I? Yeah. <sighs> India 
Bravo X-ray, runway no, left, touch and go. Touch and go, India Bravo X-ray. They're raising the nose, what should you be doing now? Pointing. How does the aspect look? Uh, very high. Or do something about yeah. it? Yeah. I was watching for the airspeed. See how much energy we got? Yeah. Got a long runway though. Thanks, Sun Tower. It's Link. Uh, Sarah Fox, right? Two and a half left. Uh, ready for a second. Link 8880. Yeah, holding position. It's Link 8880. Taking over. Sarah Fox, right? Alpha, John Wick for a stop and go. Sarah Fox, right? Alpha. Alpha, we're joining Crosswind now, and uh, if available, request center with a roll through. Mm -hmm. Alpha, I'll see what I can do. Clear visual approach to this stage for runway right, number one. Clear visual approach right, number one, Oscar Zulu Alpha. November Fox at Romeo, runway left, clear to land. Clear to RM, left, runway left, November approach right, Romeo. That was going to get to the limit attitude there, that's why I took over. Yeah, yeah. Okay, so you cleared a bit high. Yeah, yeah. I, I sure did, yeah. Yeah, just be careful, because if you do that, you got nothing left. Right, okay. Thanks, Dan Grand. Indy Sir November is on Alpha for November. Indy Sir November, taxi to November. Taxi to November. Indy Sir November. Okay, handing over. If we're going to do a few more of those. <laughs> yeah. Well, you know, I was trying not to make the same mistake I did last time, but. Yeah, uh, but you sort of went too far. I, I, I certainly did, yeah. <laughs> You've got to turn towards the runway, but you don't turn beyond 90 degrees. You turn beyond 90 degrees, and then you start vectoring out. Okay, so the reason I did that was last time Jenny told me, turn so your nose is facing the threshold. And we were beyond the threshold, so that's beyond 90 degrees. But I just want to turn 90 degrees, don't I? Aim for your one-third. Yeah, yeah, okay. I mean, but the initial turn, while I'm getting it to 75, should be 90 degrees. And then reassess that. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. But you sort of yanked it and turned. We were high in the thousand feet, so it gave us an, an extra high angle. Yeah. And when we were like almost mid base, we were overlapping halfway down the runway with our second rivet line. Yeah, we were too. Your second rivet line dictates, okay, that should yeah. be on the third. Okay. Right? So, yeah, then you turn towards the runway again. That, that's what I was critical about. And that's why we floated all the way down. Yeah, oh, I, I know, I know, okay. yeah. We were way too high for sure. Yeah. yeah. So the idea yeah, being, runway, if you got to do a glide approach, China you won't always have a thousand meters. I, I know. So, so try to, try to be good with your, your energy yeah, management. Bravo and Alpha, the city of that was overshoot. Yep. Thanks, ground, the Uniform November Alpha Seminole Information Echo Request Alpha Circuit. Uniform November Alpha, start approved. Uniform November Alpha. Now, when you took over and added power, that was to get the nose down, right? That was just a caution out of the sense so we didn't... Oh, so we didn't fall out, out of the sky, right? Yeah. Or out Uniform of the air, November. yeah. So if you nose up, yeah, yeah. Power, it, it actually the supports the weight. Right, 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 I see, because we were going to be hard. Uniform November yeah. Victor, start approved. Normally what you would have done is gone round. Yeah, gone round, yeah. It was a normal landing, but because it was a glide approach, I wanted just to see how far you would have got yeah, on right. your own. Yeah, right. Sounds good. No, I don't think you were expecting it either. <laughs> well, yeah. I'll park on the right. Yep. Turning a bit more. Okay, centralize the rudder. Not quite. There it is. Good. Let's pull it all the way back to idle, see what okay. it idles at. 700? Oh, 
You're stronger than me, I guess. Yeah, well, yeah. 700 shutdown, parking brake is us. Lights and PETA switch is off, avionics off. Off, off. Throttle's at 900, check that cut, looks good. Throttle to 1100. Cut off.